Hezbollah and its backer Iran made a serious mistake by assassinating political activist Luqman Salim, even though investigations remain stalled and justice has yet to be served, Lebanese politician and journalist said. The assassination and related events have fueled growing opposition to the Iranian axis even in areas where Hezbollah wields influence such as Al-Adusiya in southern Lebanon, where Salim was shot to death on February 4th. Iran's self-described axis of resistance has been used over the years to refer to an alliance between Tehran and its state-funded terror groups across the Middle East. Iran's proxies are working on several fronts to impose the Islamic Republic public's hegemony and expansionist policies in the region. In return, Tehran provides its Axis partners with all the money, weapons, and support they need. Salim, a leading secular voice in the Shia community and an outspoken critic of Iran and its militia group Hezbollah, was found dead in his car near the southern town of Tefata. Salim's assassination is akin to the killings of journalists and activists by Iran-backed militias in Iraq, most notably the killing of Iraqi academic Hisham al-Hashemi, who exposed the Iraqi and regional media cell run by by the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps IRGC from Baghdad. Lebanese politicians and journalists claim that Salim's murder is part of an effort to silence all those who call loudly for the implementation of Resolution 1559 and the disarmament of armed militias such as Hezbollah.